What's going on, Twitch? We're at the Sunday. We've made it. Chris and I are doing good. Hope you all are doing good. We got KOTOR. More of the KOTOR. So, in the famous words of Bork, we got wrestling going on later tonight. Let's do this! Here, here. Ooh. Oh, we're gonna let you start. Here we go. We're gonna let you start out here. Yep. I can begin. And, uh, yeah. Let's do it. Continuing the KOTOR Bro Tour playthrough. <clears throat> Bet your bottom dollar. We are progressing now. Yeah. Yeah. Acknowledgement. Tome of Tulloch Horde. Yep. Yes. It's gonna be our first tomb. Yep, first of uh first of the four. Alright. Oh. Yeah, we'll leave it alone. We don't need that. that chair oh yeah, here I got I got room! I changed the position of the Xbox, so we got a little more room to play with. Oh, Ooh! That's nice. Level 2 lightning! That is what it is, technically. Ooh, dunked. Isn't that what they say in Grandma Sports? Oh, yeah. yeah. Looks like it's falling apart. Yeah. Can you move your water bottle too? Yeah, Thanks. absolutely. I just want to see how everything's performing. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Hello, Blizzard! Happy Sunday from here. How's it hanging? Yeah, just force wave, I guess. Crowd control like no other. Right. It's kind of the best thing to do when you're going up against six plus enemies. Pretty good EXP as well, I like that. But uh probably no loot. Oh wait. There's corpse. Could be better. Someone's been playing up since last night. Oh yeah, you think you might have ate something your tummy's not settling well with? Shyrak. Okay. Oh, look at all these things. Well, they're pretty weak, though. Nice. Probably something you ate. Fair enough, fair enough. Yeah. Well, take it easy. I hope Make you sure... feel better soon. Yeah. Drink some liquids. Alright. And it's just a just resting and just laying low is kind of the best thing you can do when your stomach isn't feeling right. Oh man, dude, these soldiers. Yeah, they got a lot of credits. Well, look at the Sith troopers. Rich they look boys. like, but they look like zombies. Well, kind of a thing. They're kind of decaying. Yeah, that they've too. probably been there for a couple mm -hmm. years or something. Probably been there for a while. Can't loot that guy. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> All right, so we can just keep going this way then. Already checked that. Ancient console. 
Open the door. Here we go. Another corpse. Oh. Battle armor. And a blast. Was that a Mandalorian? Uh oh. Fumes surround you. Your party chokes and falls over. Except HK. Uh oh. Alright. <laughs> Little bow. Oh, maybe... Okay, okay. That's really cool, then. Makes me curious, then, with the uh, the people I was seeing at the mall, I was seeing the other day, that were playing the uh, Pokemon Go. Oh, we remember him. Mm hmm Jorak. Oh, dude, you probably didn't see it, but did you see that Diablo video I sent you? No, not yet. Dude, it's coming out on Switch. Oh, mm -hmm. it's very tempting. Sounds cool. So tempting. Switch has got a lot of cool names now. Ooh, shiny ditto, congrats. Definitely. That's sweet. Awesome. I wonder, would a, a shiny ditto affect for shiny breeding? Oh, or does that not work wow. like that? That'd be cool. You could become a very rich person if that's the case. I don't know how that stuff works anymore, though. I haven't played since Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. Yeah. I miss it, though. Pokemon seems well, like a Soul lot of Silver fun. would be an exception, too. Yeah, that came out after You, you were playing around that era, though. Yeah. Mid 2000s, maybe. Around there. That guy's nothing but a meat bag. Like, legit meat bag. I'm surprised HK didn't do anything. Challenge him. No, no, is that any kind of action? So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get mm. it right, and I torture Miko. Get it wrong, Miko here is a bit odd. He probably won't be able to take much more punishment. I don't know what you think of Miko. Make Can I attack him? I don't know. Then I must assume you did not know the correct answer. Set out. Is that that he was saying? Okay, a group of humans threatened by danger animals. They played. Well, now you just at any rate. He... We'll see what happens. Yeah, we'll Friends, see. You discover an aspect of the force that gives you great power. Do you share it? Sweet, sweet. 
Yeah, does also sound like another uh, another popular voice actor. I've heard, I've heard this guy and some stuff. Definitely like on Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon. And video games. I mean, I don't know if you die. See? That's what he said earlier. What? <laughs> yeah, kill him. Do some force lightning on him. Give him a taste of his own medicine. Oh. Well. That sucks. Oh, that really fucking sucks. Can he sucks. go in there? How do I res? Uh, you gotta kill him. Does he still get EXP though, right? Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. You might have to just run. You're gonna have to range him. Just make sure he doesn't hit you. Throw grenades at him or something. Flamethrower? One million years detention. Some weird rogue Sith teacher. Oh, he's doing some weird force drain right now. I think Kander needs to heal. Yeah, flank the time. Yes. There nice. we go. Hey, get up, kid. They're like holding hands. <laughs> Mikael's dead. Yeah. We'll be here for a second. You just force kill yourself. He died though. That was too bad. Yeah, it sucks. Because he could have been like, hey, thanks. Right. Could have got some uh, force points, some light side. Yeah, man. Whoa. Can you bash it? Okay, an Ooh, artifact. Mask? I think it, it was a mask. It was his horns. I don't You're know. Right. If... Yeah. You can, but... You can't equip it. You don't have the prerequisites. All we gotta assemble is mask. Mm. Is there more doors you can open back there? I don't believe so. Okay. We're assembling the mask, I think, through all the tombs. Possibly. <sighs> that sucked that that dude died, but oh well. Yeah. It's gotta mm. keep moving. Exactly. He did come in clutch, though. Yeah, and, like, the funny part is, like, none of that, like, really... The Force Lightning didn't kill me or anything. It was no. just more of a dialogue opportunity to get Force or Dark... Light Side or Dark Side. So do you want to do two tombs, and then I'll do two tombs? 
Sure, we can do that. All right. Now um, I'll just run across the next one. Okay. I call Market Regnos. Yeah, I figured you'd want. This one seems cool though. And Naga very, Sandow. Very familiar. Mama Sandow. Mama Sandow. The door is locked and will not open at the moment. Maybe we gotta go back to that one. Go back to which one? Like, it's not ready yet. Do you think there's a different tomb I have to go to next? Yeah. Yeah, so go to that one to your left. back there. <laughs> now where's Candrus? Oh. Ninja. I'm right here, Christian. Alright, Candrus. <laughs> Hopefully we can go past this door. Good deal. Hey, what's up, Atreyu? Alright. Tomb number two. Oh. Oh, well. Nice, here we go. Not too bad myself, thank you. Been a decent Sunday so far here. Yep, yep, he was ready to rock and roll. You asked right before the stream started to really? uh, don the cap. Well, I was wearing a different hat at first before the stream started, and then I figured oh, I'll just wear the Sega hat. Ooh, yes, ooh. I'll drink some agua. There's an arm right there. You can check out. Data pad. There was a Sith corpse. That's a little creepy. That was very weird. Yeah. There was another Sith corpse up here I wanted to see if we could look at. Not you. This guy. Nope. Nada! Uh oh, what the? Am I supposed to put something in here? I don't know what you do here. Well, that data pad's probably important. I wish you could just sneak right around. Oh, give item. Press X. The data pad? Hmm. Or that Na Naga Sato mask or whatever. Let's see what we have. Uh, 
Oh man, it might open those droids, but we'll do what we gotta do. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know if it's the mask, though. Yeah, I don't know. Well, you could try. <clears throat> Try that data pad. Ooh, really? When you hover the mouse over the unfollow button, you get a small text balloon with unfollow. But on some streams, the text balloon with unfollow just stays there until you refresh. Ah, weird. Wow. Yeah, there's something we gotta yeah, put in what there. What was that data pad you had? You could have put that in there. You think just putting the data pad in there will, uh... I mean, it was on the ground. And it was the closest object to it. There'll probably have to be some type of crystal. Oh, valid. There's a flying creature. You see it? I think it was this. I don't think it was. Put the bantha fodder in there. It's not that one. A Sith student to the tomb. Yep. There's got to be a way to get past the obelisk blocking the bridge. It seems to be made of some kind of unstable material. I'm willing to bet some kind of energy discharge will set it off. Blaster fire isn't doing the trick. However, I'll try to find some kind of explosive. I just hope that guard droid over there won't defunct as it looks. What do you think then? An explosive? Like putting a bomb in here? Hmm. Do we have like a mine or something? Because I could have sworn we had like a uh, like detonator what? pack. No, but it was like a special inventory item. Hey, what's up, Pete? Hey, what's up, Pete? What's up, dude? Damn, yeah, that's look, weird. Look, look for like a detonator. Detonator, huh? Yeah, I thought we had like a detonation pack. Could be wrong though. There's a frag. Hey, late lunch. Sunday's been going good, pretty chill. Yeah, we had a late lunch too. Yeah, we grabbed my burger today. It was phenomenal. I actually asked to put the uh, Cajun seasoning on onion rings, and whew, that was good. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm thinking a thermal detonator. See? Look at that. Okay. Now, what got do I... Job done. Now, what do I do here? They got shields on. They look pissed. Oh, I think I know what I need to do. You need to go put another bomb in the other one. Oh, but I can't. Maybe just scum save? Or scum load, whatever it's called. Maybe. Just load it. Yep. Well, that knocks us back a little bit. Yeah, I'll try it out. Uh, well, while you go back there, I'm gonna go get some water. Do that, and, um... We'll do a Beavis and Butthead card here. Okay, so you're gonna have to tell me which one it is. Yeah. I'll wait for it, actually. Let me just get back right in here. Alright. Oh, yeah, we just gotta break that door. That's fine. Um, let's see... I can just hit the home button, right? 
don't have to. You should just leave it where it is. I mean, okay. I like the Korriban music. It's fine. It's fine. Um, I'll show you the card real quick so you can get your water. Oh my gosh. Yeah, pretty good, right? Pretty Pete, good. It's a Lucas card. Lucas card. I'm right. just kidding, Lucas. Love you, dude. Wherever Lucas is, shout outs to you, Lucas. He's Hope there. you're doing good. Okay, card. It's called uh, Infants. And here, here, here we go. It's a uh, baby butthead in a uh, in a cradle, and he's got a baby bottle right up the right up the schnoz. Yeah, infants. Pretty heavy. Pretty. Hang on, let's see if I can get a little bit. Look at that. Come on. There you go. There's the focus. There you go. Boom. In fence. Baby bottles are cool. All right. Here we go. 6923 in fence. They put Butthead in prison before he could walk. Oh, this is probably uh, Beavis going. <laughs> They uh they put Butthead in prison before he could walk. <laughs> he was like a uh, repeat offender or something. He was always offending and stuff. And like uh, the best thing about being a baby is that you can pinch a loaf in your pants and somebody else has to clean it up. Being mature sucks. Because like you can't only pinch loaves in certain places. And you have to clean it up yourself or buzz cut makes you do push-ups fair enough uh beavis predicts if you see a chick and she's naked and she like wants you you'll get a swelling in your pants obviously okay i think i hit my quota for beavis and butthead today in fence in fence i've i've hit my max on those boys yeah, great. GG's. <laughs> yeah, I was really surprised by that card. I was like, what? There's a baby butthead card? Wrong one. I'll take it. I'll take it. Not PG. Not PG, Jake. Not PG. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Fabulous. Yeah, they're they're fun stuff. They're fun cards. Uh, the thing to keep in mind is, uh, we, I think we're about halfway through the, uh, oh, we're not even that deep, we're fine. Um, there's 150 cards in that set, and we're about halfway, so I've been thinking about, uh, once, if and when the day we get all 150, think about maybe what the next, uh, maybe card collection or something you know, more fun channel point stuff. Alright, so now we'll drop a save. Alright, I'm hoping... Oh, I can't even... U I can't even access that one, actually. Get out of here. Hey Chris, we actually can't access this one right now, so I'm probably just gonna have to toss needs. Gonna have to duel it out with the droids. I guess so. That's fine. We weren't that far behind, so. Okay. I'm not worried about it.
should be just thermal detonator, right? Yeah. Thermal detonator. Good thing we had a couple of those. Oh, jeez. Come on. Back down we go. Rip. Alright. Then we got the Power Ranger droids getting pissed off. Alright. What's the uh, ion, right? I think ion grenades are good against them. Or try many different grenades with different characters. Stun I don't droid. Know. Yo, Pete, which, uh, which yeah. match are you most looking forward to tonight out of, uh, main... Yeah, dude, look at these iron gren grenades. It's Elimination Chamber, right? Fastlane's next month. Yes, Blizzard. I did have a question for that for Cobra Kai. If you got a few faves, who do you like? I gotta know which match Pete wants to see the most tonight. Oh, that too. Chamber. For a second, I thought it was Fastlane, but that's next month. And then Mania's gonna be the same as last year, with all the pirate yeah. ships and stuff. Yeah, it's like a, gonna be, I guess, almost like a part two. True. It's a good way to look at it. Yes, I was You got a few, but can you guess whom might be? Well, I would like to hope almost everyone and anyone who watches Cobra Kai likes Johnny Lawrence has to be in their like top five. I would like to think a, a, a toss up, if not both. I would like to think maybe uh, Dimitri or Hawk. And then, um,. You know who doesn't who doesn't love Daniel? Dimitri. Excellent, excellent. Yeah, Dimitri. Whew. Season one, interesting. But then season two and then and so on. What? Nothing. Dude, Dimitri, Dimitri. dude, he's got he's got the Dungeon Lord, man. He's got the Dungeon Lord karate. Oh, what's the switch right. to? Everyone dies, game over. No, just open the door. Oh, I'm mistaken. I will say too, I, I do I do like Miguel. I think Miguel's pretty awesome as well. But Dimitri and Hawk are just, I don't know, more more of the personal fave. And then, um... Mm. Miguel had an awesome... Dude, Miguel is like, he's kind of like Rockley for me, in a way, metaphorically speaking, just because they both kind of had to go through a very impossible hurdle. What the hell? That was weird. Swords? Weapons? Uh-oh. Sith Ghost. Whoa, that was weird. Yeah, very much the journeyman. There you go. I get 50-50, though, about Johnny's... Johnny's kid. Yeah, say the second one. I had a name once. A junta Paul. And Sam's alright. Tori's alright. I was one of many. We were servants of the dark side. 
I think all the kids are cool, though, overall. Like, everyone in the show. I mean, that video game. I kind of almost want to buy a Switch copy to own it, just for fun. Battery life. Good. Yet we embraced it in secret. We were discovered. We did. We hid from the Jedi, but it was not they who destroyed us. We destroyed each other. We desired each other. <laughs> Silly. And so here our old secret is bent. So much remain. Do I remain? My sword, I filled it with my pride, and it is I am dead as of course you do. You I wish my sword to be. If, if you are wise, you will not. There are three blades within my sarcophagus. Only one is truly my sword. Find the sword that is mine and place it on the statue. If it is truly mine, then it is mine. Then you must die. I do remember one thing. I am that which grips the heart in fright. Harkens night and silences the light. Fright night light. My sword long not ago. Go then. Fright night light. Well, I already picked them all up. Mute, what's good, my dude? Happy Sunday. Tori is kind of a savage. Yeah, she is. Sassy savage. Friday Fright Night? Kinda. We're, we, we got this kind of bonk quest here where place the sword. So do we die if we put the wrong one there? Oh, here, hang on. Right, so we gotta go... Because he gave us a few different swords. There was a Vibro Sword. Oh, yeah. Kraith Double Sword. Maybe. And then there was like a sword, and then. Could be this one. Could be it. I mean, if that's what you think it is. Keep it in mind. <laughs> Hey! Hi, McTeddy! Thanks! Hope your weekend's been going super, too! It's not that double blade. Hmm, did we miss one, then? Because they, they all three had kind of like a special name. You know, I don't think it'd be that one. Uh, it's going good. We're at Corbon right now. So there was that yeah, one. I mean, the it, first one. we can guess and check, of course. Then there was the sword, not steel. Oh, could it be this one, the silver line sword? I think that was the other one we grabbed from there. Try it. Let's do the silver line first. Okay. We'll see what happens. <coughs> oh, 
No, we didn't die. No, that is not the one. My ancient sword is black as the night sky. Oh. I am sorry. All right. Got him. Mm, you could just blow him. I could. But if we're just gonna kill this guy in like two seconds. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Oh, yeah, I can't do anything like that to him. Okay. Uh oh. Force heal. Wait, wait, oop. But we know what sword it is anyways now. Yep. And... I mean, it doesn't matter. If you think about it, hmm. we're doing the Jedi the right thing because we killed a uh, Sith Force Ghost. Yes, we did. So... Sith Spirit. Sith Spirit. Um, I would say we're more light side. We did one point get kind of close to the dark side, but Christian's... Uh, Thought process to it made sense because Terrace got dunked on regardless. Yep. So. We were making bank on Terrace. We were. That was the goal. Uh -oh, oh, here we go. Who's this guy? I saw you come in here and I rather figured you'd make it all the way to the sarcophagus. Good to see I wasn't wrong. Isn't it obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work in retrieving the sword of a Junta Paul for some time. It's been quite a wait. Warning! Touch the master's blade and lose an arm, feedback. Now that you have it, I just thought I'd really you out. Too good. It must be quite a burden after all. Nice try. I may not know what the sword looks like, but I'm no gullible fool. I'm not about to pass up a chance to impress Master Uthar. I may like you well enough, but being a Sith is all about taking chances when the moment is right. So make it easier on both of us. Hand over the sword. Need to do things the hard way, eh? You're an idiot. <laughs> yeah, I know. You're, You're an idiot. idiot. This guy's a straight up moron. Yeah, I'm gonna 1v3 NBD. I can do it. Sure. Sure. <laughs> I better have, yeah. Just challenged the shield. That didn't go well. Yeah. Believe that. Does that make HK uh, Ambrose? Not even a lightsaber. Yeah, yeah, it's some of those ancient Sith using swords instead of lightsabers. Okay, so I think... Uh, oh, sure. You'll get to do the next two tombs then. I mean, it's only 4,000 years ago. Yeah. It's not too bad. Wanted that silly sword. Oh, we've got action right away. Yeah, this is a uh, daytime exegol. Correct. <laughs> no, this Kappa. place. This place is cooler than exegol. By a long shot, true. Yeah, I still the days of playing Swotor, being a Sith Marauder, training, doing the tutorials and all that on Korriban was a really fun experience. Getting to go to the tomb and getting your lightsaber ready. It was awesome. I'm kind of glad that they didn't put Corban in the movie still, because, I mean, just going here in the video games makes it special. It does. It does. There's a lot of droids in here. Oh my god, yeah. You should just run up. Oh yeah. There you go. Should I just force wave it? Yeah, just... For just keep running up and for... Well, 
about to be on a lot of force power here. Yeah, same here, McTeddy. At first, for me, because I've never gotten this far now with getting to play with Chris, which is just awesome. Like, the mechanics are there, but for myself, it was just kind of, I don't know, finding, finding the time, the maturity, the appreciation. And just thanks, Bioware. Thanks for making a fun Star Wars RPG. You gotta heal up now. Alright, we're good. We are Gooch. Uh-oh! What?! What is this assassin?! What?! HK's brother?! HK's grandfather. No! Rogue Assassin Droid and his evil? Dude, he looks amazing! No! Hack him! Save him! I'm scared. Oh my god! No! Don't kill him! Leave this tomb! He he's got like a cool spear on his back. Oh my god, and he's got like the double satch like IG-11. Oh no, that was like a rifle on his back. Oh, he's dead! No! See a nerd. No! Oh well. Rip. God, that droid was so cool. Hey, it is what it is, man. How robot murder. Robot lives matter. I already have a robot at home. Two, technically. That thing was just so cool looking. I know, I looked I've down. never seen that before. I've never seen that kind of... I had of... to fight it. I had no other choice. I, I totally understand. It's just, that was a really cool looking rogue assassin droid. Yeah, it looked really awesome. Like, next to HK, that design was just... Just so cool. Yeah, they need to make an HK Black Series figure. Like, now. So we have the sword. We have the horns. Marco Ragnos gauntlets. Nice. You probably can't equip them because you're probably gonna. Oh. He might not be able to yet. There's nothing else I can really grab. Well, because you're gonna turn all that stuff into the. Yeah? To the dude. The dude's doing all their dirty work. Well, yeah, you're doing all their... Part of my French, but you're doing all their bitch work. Yeah, Like, well, they should be going in these tombs, getting this stuff. Well, they're all gonna be dead soon. Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah. Clean them out. Yeah. So, can you remind me again, how, how does Malik have relation to all these guys? Are they just, like, underlings, or... Because now he's, like, leader of the Sith, technically, now? So people on Korriban will have More to... so the Sith fleet, I would assume. Right. <clears throat> but he is like, yes, like the Dark Lord right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the story's killer. And, Story again, just good. like a thing for me with, like, maturity and, like, Star Wars. Because, like, first time playing it, it, I just, I don't know. I it was, There was just something for me that was just not clicking and getting. But now, like, totally see it totally understand it and the connections the parallels mr revan hk corban yeah terrace like the whole game everything it's i mean just wait till you play kotor 2 if you think mm -hmm. this is good yeah it gets yeah even better. yeah yeah kotor 2 They're is gonna be really amazing good, especially we'll throw a couple mods in to make it the ultimate experience well, we can't do anything with that door. Probably that's the final part of the trial after you get everything, maybe. Yeah, that's probably going to be it. Because then you'll gain his favor. Then he'll be like, go in the last tomb and do X, Y, and Z. KOTOR 2 was interesting, too. Oh, yo, McTeddy. And maybe anyone and everyone in chat. So, if you guys thought that James Bond thing was ridiculous, and by the way, if and when the time because originally i wanted to stream goldeneye on n64 which 
you know, golden ion N64 is cool and all, but I think if I want a really fun experience, I have it all at the get-go. But yeah, we've talked about it. The James Bond Xbox Live finally got thrown out on the internet. Definitely want to stream that and do that run one day. But continuing the rare love, I'm back here. Um, Planet Dinosaur got leaked out. Yeah, exactly, McTaddy. Definitely aligning with you right there. But Planet Dinosaur, the original, like, Star Fox... Uh, is it Star Fox Adventure? Star Fox Adventure? Yeah, there's a build of it out there on the internet now. And um, apparently it's kind of 6 out of 10 playing on emulator. But if you can get it on a flash cart... And then, like, an EverDrive, and then play that off an N64. Apparently, it's like... Like, it, you can play it. You can experience that. I kind of wanted to see what that's all about. That's just... It blows my mind when we... When things like that happen. So what, what should oh, I hug. Oh, McTaddy. So much dialogue to choose You didn't from. know that? Okay. Really, really? About Star Fox Adventure? Okay. Well, dude, I'm glad I could share that. I, I, Siliconara is a big website I go to to check my video game news, and they had it the other night, and I was like, I know there's a lot of people that are excited for that game because it was going to be one of the last... In <coughs> oh, I can't breathe. Grape stomping lady. That was supposed to be one of the last N64 games. And it... It's so weird with Star Fox, man. Nintendo is so weird to Star Fox. It is... It, it, it's so weird to me how Nintendo treats Star Fox now. Like, I, I just have the weirdest... Perspective of Nintendo's relationship with Star Fox now. It's so weird with their projects. I gotta shut up real quick. Go now. You have done well. Just turning everything into him. Ah, my old master. Slapped on late development, it is. Yeah, dude, because it's like they ke they kept trying to get games done, and they get so close, and then oh, it's so weird. Like Star Fox Two gets canned. Star Fox Adventure on N sixty four gets canned. Uh, I don't know, it's just like, the the newer Star Fox games aren't like, I don't know, I feel like the last, like, prominent Star Fox game was Star Fox Assault on GameCube, and everything else has been basically rehashes of Star Fox 1, and that kind of sucks. Yeah, Castlevania is kind of the same thing, too. I mean, Kid Icarus Uprising was supposed to be a Star Fox game, nice. but then they were like, nah, we're doing Kid Icarus Uprising. And yeah, don't get, I mean, it's same, Me Metal Gear now is in that same lull, especially after the, the fallout of Kojima. It just, it sucks. It sucks. Here. Swear that Dinosaur Planet was always planned as Star Fox. Star Fox 2 was great. I wish we could have gotten Star Fox 2 with gameplay with 64 graphics. Agreed. Hey, Baron, good to have you here also, by the way. Uh, yeah, dude, did you hear the news about that? That Star Fox Assault leak and all that hype? Uh oh. Maybe you can do better than I. This <clears throat> Free his ass. Maybe. Dude, look at his clothes. It's like your uh, noodles. <laughs> in the in the microwave. Oh. No, he kind of looks like those guys from Terrace. Kind of, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, like the hobo clothes. But I'm just saying yeah. they look burnt and nasty. How do you drug him? We can partially thank Miyamoto for that, I guess. As in, what, Miyamoto canning us? Canning all of our Star Fox games? I mean, yeah, it's 
Star Fox, Metroid, F Zero, dude. Fuck. Part of my French, but when's new new ice climbers? Yeah, the Canyon of Two. <laughs> Can Candorus talk to him? I want to hear Candorus talk like that. <laughs> he sounds like uh, one of uh, like one of the Twi'lek dudes. Yeah, Tim the Toolman Taylor, Agnu, how we doing? But also another good, in, in a higher note of news, there are a couple cool Switch games coming out next week. Ghosts and Goblins Resurrection and Bravely Default 2. So that's kind of hype. What do you think we should do here? Trust me. I tried that. Oh. Uh, what's the serum? Like the truth serum? But yeah. Day's going good. Sunday's been pretty well so far. Staying warm, staying well. We had a killer lunch today. Kotor is going great. The Bro Tour co-op playthrough. And we got some wrestling watching later tonight with Panda Pete. Yeah. It's going to be awesome. Ooh, I am hoping though later tonight. I did pick this up on Steam the other day because it was very inexpensive. And you might want to check it out because I know you like roller coasters. I know you like Thrillville. I bought Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, and that's kind of like Thrillville. It's like the first 3D roller coaster. I've heard mixed things about it, but for like 12 bucks, I was like, dude, I'm going to give it a whirl. I'm going to see what's going on with it. So, have you played Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, McTeddy? I might get Divinity Original Sin 2. Ooh, Dark Side. Well, all right. You have not? Fair enough. Oh, Gucci. Oh, well, he just ran away. Is he gonna snatch on me? Dude, that guy, like, clipped through the cage. And just died. Mmm. What, did we go through here? No. Oh, he's fighting him now? This is amazing. Is oh. that even him? He died now. <laughs> yeah, release him. So can I just open up every cage? Maybe. Slice the console and then... Fifty?! We'd have to go buy a bunch of spikes. Oh, what if I do it one, one by one? Can you do it one by one? I don't know if you can free them. You're just gonna fight them all? You give me a weapon, shit. I'm going to use it. Run, I freed you. Oh, well. What are you doing? Okay. Let's just free everybody. 
Well, they look like, I don't know. They stopped. Oh, okay, just do what you want. I'll, we'll watch it. We'll just see what happens. Yep. Oh! <laughs> How many more we got? Two more? I have no idea what Chris is doing, but... Oh. I think I used up all the prisoners. <laughs> Kenra's waste no time in see, shooting see? that prisoner. Oh yeah, they're fine. See? They're just chilling. Uh oh, you just triggered them though. Run, I freed you. Not well, free XP, I guess. Just leave that guy alone. Can be cool. He's free. Where are my light side points for that guy? As long as he doesn't move, he is free for the rest of his life there. He can sneak out now. Nutty. Straight up nutty. Let me go this way. That's Sith Academy entrance. Yeah, definitely more of a... Uh, Jolie Grey Jedi up in here, if you will. Huh. Another hopeful wandering about the Academy. <sighs> huh. As if I didn't have better things to Well, Jorak Un would it seems that if you want prestige now be gone. Um thought. Yeah, same here. Big fan of how the uh, light and dark meter worked. Loved it in Swotor, especially playing with friends and we would dice roll. And uh, whoever won the roll would get to have the pick. It was fun for raids and such with the outcomes. Yeah, yeah, they were fun. But just that, that, that same hand gesture, you know, just... They're, they were so limited to with their uh, hand gestures. It was silly. Oh, wait. We got to go back to the other person in the academy. Mm-hmm. The other teacher. Oh, yeah. Got to gain more favor before we can enter that final tomb. That's pretty handy, too. If you're more on dark side, then dark side skills are more buffed. You gotta be all in on the evil, right? We get close on there, but we try not to. Right. We still try to find balance. So, uh, where's this academy? Do you need to go see that lady? You're uh, the, the purple, other, the, the purple Twi'lek lady that wanted to. Uh, isn't she around in here somewhere? I think. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, that's evil. Hey, light side points. What? Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alwyn. Oh, well, thank you. It's very fitting for uh, the light side version of Revan. Oh my god, hilarious. Light side points. I must admit I've never really understood it very well. Enough to please Master Youth though, I guess, but I still have trouble with it. I do too. I do too. And I'm trying to like phrase this the best way, but like I really have liked how they've handled the character. Well, I just don't feel like we just gotta be patient. I thought maybe I did it first. We gotta be patient. There's things in the works. You just hope those things are all gonna be all the check marks that we're looking for. I feel ya, <laughs> too, Big Teddy. I feel ya. I want to know sooner than later. Oh, there you go. Four storm level three. 
lightning or level three lightning. But yeah, we need more of this era. They need to bring it back, talk about it, cannon it up, HK, Revan, Bastila, hell, even two seconds of Karth. Right. Anything. Okay. Anything! Is it? But the, uh, I can't remember her name, I feel terrible. But our purple Twi'lek master, she was around here, she has her own kind of spot. I just, she could be somewhere else now. Yeah, it's just, you know, that's what's hard again about the, the patience, because there's, you know, lots of different Star Wars projects in the mix and all that jazz. Down here? Is it not the, like, the yellow uh, glob on the map? Oh, her again. Dude, I can't believe she's got, like, some buzz cut haircut. Like, what? Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I can't wait for Bad Batch, personally. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, wasn't her, though? Voice is kind of familiar, though. Did she do something else that maybe we all would uh, know from a different video game or show of some caliber? Also, Baron, if you were here... Oh, there. There she is. Yeah. So you threw up Bon. Did you? Good news travels quickly. Well done. He wouldn't have made a good Sith anyway. One less opponent is an excellent result, regardless of how it occurs, correct? Now then, something you needed. Uh, maybe nothing else then, if she doesn't have much. What's the first option? How do I get more prestige? Mm. You are very close to... Okay. Do we need to put that sword back in the statue? Because we picked the wrong one. Probably... Probably need to go do that. That's probably what opens that other door. Probably, yeah. Well, then you know what that means. Force run. There are some more Metal Gear Solid voice actors. Everyone did voices for this game, apparently. That's <laughs> that's awesome, though. That just. Yeah. What about Steve Bloom? Is that his name? Oh. Steve Bloom might have done something for Kotor, Dude, at least some sort of. He would have an awesome voice for Candorus, but Candorus is still cool. Yeah, Candorus with Wolverine voice. More like Tank Dempsey. Wait, what did I see or not see from the last Kotor stream? Uh, the Yavin Station. We were there for a moment. He went to Kashyyyk and then... Mm -hmm. Oh, that ship. The tractor beam. Oh, right, right. I mean, we did have to fight Malak. We had a duel with Malak and then Bastila sacrificed herself. But we didn't sense her presence, like, mm -hmm. dying. We didn't sense her dying at all. Oh, is this the wrong place? No, this should be the right one. Let's go back to the statue over there and see if you can put the other sword in there. Oh, or not. Is there another spot that opened up? Well, can't we just go to the other tomb or is that not going to work for us? I don't know. Shit. No, I already pulled that guy. Can go over there. Wish I could just jump across there. Right? Seems like you could. But that other tomb, we can't go in.
They're all here. We might have to snitch on the purple Twi'lek. That might be the next thing we have to do. Think about it. I don't really. I think though we're kind of given the chance of either we can side with her or the other guy. Yeah, I don't know. But maybe we. Because the other. Uh... Oh, hello to you. You're new to the academy, aren't you? I can't say we've ever met. Galen Law, at your service. Aren't these tunes fascinating? We had no idea the Sith were here so long ago. Not from this far back. Or at least what records do exist are Because wasn't there still the Sith Code? Back to a period when the Sith were first formed, before their exile into the far reaches of space. It's quite fascinating. I've been working on a translation of some of the runes by this tomb. I'm quite excited. This may very well be the tomb of a chapter, Paul. Of course. Don't make Because we've checked all the, uh... All the tombs, but one is inaccessible right now, right? Well, let's see if there's more to these tombs. Like, let's see if we checked out the whole area. Yeah. You can courtesy check. Yeah, that looks like it. Okay. Why did I put that there? That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. It's gonna blow up now. You can't break it? No. Hmm. Okay. Anything in quest log? In that, in that cave? In the cave. Always take a peek. Way the Sith. Go around the academy in the valley, find ways. Hmm. What about the reload? Like, if you go back and load, what are the save spots at? How do we save? You could load there, that's right putting it back in the sword and you could put the other one in. Do you remember which one we put in last time? It was the silver one. All right. Hopefully this works. And I... Th we did this one. Right, so it's one of the other two. Let's see. And then you gotta go... Yes, that is the one. There you That's go. the blade that destroyed me. Take it. Take it and the other blades even. Take them and go. My darkness awaits me. Our oldest secret is buried, but not here. I remember nothing else. I cannot help you. I shall not tell you. Our oldest secret, I shall not be gone. Uh oh, then you can find him. Um, or disappointment, the great Anjutta Paul. Uh oh. Whatever. Yeah, just don't use any of your force moves. Just gonna use that lightsaber on him. I can use force moves. Right, but I'm saying you can't like force wave this guy or anything.
everything. GG. Dude, he was dead. Yep, he was. No, and then his, his body doesn't... You did? They did. Oh, cool. But yeah, that's it then. So I guess we'll see with that. Now we have to go back to Mark Regnos, right? Didn't you already do Regnos, or...? Maybe. Unless there's something else you have to go back and do in Ragnos. I mean, you had two. Du I did my two dungeons. Mine were fine. But you can't get in that other door, though. I think this was it. That's oh, this jabber. And I rather figured you'd make it all the way. Isn't it obvious? Warning. Touch the map. Hey, that's tight. You caught the vod. Hell yeah. Me bag. No. Impressive bravado, I'm sure. Do you honestly think I would let an opportunity to impress? I may like you well enough, but being a sin is all. You'll take it over my dead body. Just let me get out. Oh wait, no. This isn't a negotiation. Need to do things the hard way, eh? Shoot them, guys. Goodbye, meat bag. <laughs> Got him good. Good stuff, Chris. Hey, that was HK, not me. Well, hopefully this helps. Because we know what sword it is now, technically. Because you were correct. Yep. I'm just not sure if there's like a statue or somewhere where you're supposed to put those artifacts on to open a tomb or something. Well, we didn't talk to the other person last time, right? At first, about, like, the mm, sword? Yeah. Maybe we could go to her for first. I act Yeah, I, I remember that. There was kind of, like, a, a way that you could joke I'm through the, see, like, the characters. The right oh, what's that way. door, though? Sippy. <clears throat> or the other building. <laughs> what's the joke about Mandalorians? Whoa, Obsidian Aliens RPG? What is this? Whoa, hold on. That was really weird. So you managed one less opponent. You have added Obsidian Aliens RPG, huh? Let's take a look. Oh. Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Maybe I can go. Find a clip or something of it. I have the 
That should be on YouTube. Well done. The lesson is learned, I believe. Go now. You are... Ah, finally, the genuine sword. I knew that this relic would be unearthed in time. This looks kind of cool from what I'm seeing. Flowing through it. Well done. You have impressed me greatly. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have. Were they pretty close to finishing it up, McTeddy? Ah, my old master. Still, unless you. No, you don't have to. You're fine. I can do that on my own. It appears my. Regardless, you have impressed me with your worthy. Go now. You have done well, but you have not. Maybe it's better. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't know. That might be our only last option. Oh? It is no more complicated than I said. Perform impressive deeds, or bring me a suitably valuable artifact from the Valley of the Dark Lords. Observation. We could begin by slaughtering the inhabitants of this building, Master. Would that be impressive? Really, however, you should seek out Euthura and get her advice. She is your trainer. Didn't you, can't you show him, like, the horns and everything? Didn't you already show him the horns, yeah, the sword? Reaction. You have gained considerable prestige. You are very close to the end. Do not falter now. Well, you got some stuff. Can you talk to him again, or...? Him, or...? Yeah, he kind of just, like, keeps talking. Doesn't... <laughs> HK's got a good point, though. Impressed, Master Uth. The first and easiest way would be for you to learn the code of the Sith and speak. Shall I go on? Can you maybe do the whole thing on the Sith code, because then after. Peace is a lie. Yep. There is only passion. Because now you can probably talk to him about it. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory. Because that's probably what we're missing. I think I got it. Master it and it shall serve you well. You are very close. You got EXP for that. That's a good sign, wouldn't you say? Yep. Yeah. yeah, I know, right? That's funny. Greetings, young one. I know this code here, and I can, just in case... Do your research. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Passion. Through passion, I gain... Strength. Yeah. Through strength, I gain... Serenity. Power. Power. Through power, I gain... Ah, victory! Through victory... Through victory, my chains are broken. Shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing Chaps the words fun. are, however, two mm -hmm. different things. Tell me then, true or false, victory by any means is desirable. Uh, t uh technically true for the Sith. False. Unless victory proves your superiority. Oh. Sadly, it seems you did not understand. You have gained considerable... We gotta fucking redo it now. I hope you saved okay. I know the code. Okay. Peace is a lie. Passion? Through passion, I get. Strength. Through strength, I get. Victory. Oh. Power, you gain victory. Through victory. My chains are broken. The force shall free me. Yes. Go tell me then, true or false? Victory by any means False, desirable. I guess, Dwight. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have managed what? To... You could talk to him again maybe after. I'll be on my way. Considerable prestige. 
You're very close. Greetings, young one. I'll see you. You have gained cons. No, I'll go back and see if I can talk to her now. Reciting the Sith Code, interrogating the Mandalorian prisoner to find the weapons, killing runaway students, destroying or disabling a rogue assassin droid in the tomb, uncovering the sword, finding the Sith holocron inside the belly of the Tukata mother, killing the hermit in the hills, Jirak Un, Already did that. and informing uh, of Euthura's plan to overthrow him. It's been possible to pass the trials by killing all fellow students. Can't you just kill what's her name? Oh, can't you save at this guy? Dude, smart. We still have this guy. Alright, I'm just gonna for our own sake. Um, is it 4.11? Alright. Still trying to figure it up. Mandalorian prisoner. Ho, ho, ho. I don't know. Still trying to find an answer. Okay. All right, you ready for this? Sure. Activate the serum console. Small dosage. Activate the console. High dosage. Activate the console. Medium. Moderate. Wait, what? He died? What have you done? I tell you. It, well, I mean, that's what the guy, it's small, high, moderate, small, small is what he said. Wait, activate, inject. He looks so funny. He's not even like on the computer. He looks like he's just like scratching someone's back. Right, that's true. <laughs> well, I think we're more on the bad job of things. Try different methods until the dark way inject him with the serum turn. until he cooperates. The first time you want you inject him, you will get DSP. 
As well as when you extract information oh, from look. him. What? It's like anti serum. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see. We were freaking reading this wrong then, maybe. Um, alright, alright, here we go. So, activate serum console, inject truth serum small dosage. Truth small. Yep. Activate the console, inject truth serum high dosage. Then you're going to do apply anti serum moderate dosage. Thanks, internet. Okay, then activate serum again, and then inject truth serum small dosage, and then truth serum small dosage again. One more small dosage. Tell me where it is. In on my ship. There you go. Yes, I heard that. Excellent job. Thank I heard that. <laughs> Naturally, I would see rewarded, but I would prefer that it. What? What are you joking? I'm not gonna let you get away with this. I suppose one would need to be alive to go. Uh oh. Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true Sith then? Shep. Gather your anger then, and let us see who is superior. Good night, Yeah. Yes. Oh, he's dead. Good night. So that was taken care of. Ooh, what loot? What's he got? Oh, and now he's got something? He had something, yeah. Crystal green. Jedi scum. Just kidding. So, you've done two things now. That should hopefully be enough for his favor. If not, I'll have to ask if you've done other things. How ironic that I recently had his vessel scrapped for parts, then. I had assumed it had been thoroughly scanned. Apparently not. Still, you have done well in bringing me information that others could not unearth on their own. I am impressed. You have impressed me enough, by my estimation, to become a Sith in full. Congratulations. There we go. GG. You have bested the others quite completely. You have but one final test which you must take. And this requires us to travel... Wow, to really? That's really cool, because to me too, she does uh, voices for some of the other Star Wars stuff. She's voiced Leia in Padme in the animated series. So that's super cool that she's done some MGS work. A lot of MGS people up in here. Alright, let's so now we'll probably go talk to Euthera. See what she's got to say now that we've... Wait, aren't you going to talk to her? See what she's got to say now, because we've... What are you doing here? Go back to Uthar and tell him you are ready to take your final test. Our moment is at hand. Go. <laughs> little bowing animation. Hell yeah. Mark. Yep. Which is a Revan mark. Word is that one of our experimental droids went mad and escaped and is hiding in the ruins. Oh, the assassin droid. Wait, aren't you going to talk to him, or do you need to... Oh, yeah, we need to go now. I was just going to run there. So then, I take it you are ready to travel to... Oh, it's probably that last tomb. Ooh, now. almost. Not today, phone. No falling. Oh, but HK and Kenters have to stay back? <sighs> Lame. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Very well. We are now ready for your final test. You this is going to be awesome. You have earned the right to see if you shall become one of us. Indeed you have. I dislike your tone, though. What are you up to now? Nothing, of course, my master. I was merely agreeing with you. Should we not get on with the test? Yes. Yes, of course. We are in the sacred tomb of Nagasato, young one. The one discovered by Darth Malik and Darth Red Starforge Red piece here? That's what I was thinking. And reach the ancient star map yes. that lies deep within. There you will find Boom. a lightsaber, amongst other things. A lightsaber is for you, your initiation present. Return to us once you have it. You but he already has a lightsaber. Be very cautious here. This tomb is like the others in this valley. And many of its old defenses remain active. Do you understand what I have told you? Are you ready to begin? I understand. This? Good. You thorough and I will await your return. Do they not know where the star map is either? Hmm. Maybe. Uh oh. I thought the game just froze. <laughs> Does it stop me? Oh, hi. Raid. I have an idea actually. Don't we have stealth belt? Okay, I might just have to fight one big boy. Miss. Oh, okay. he's a weak boy. Size matters not. That did not sound good. Can I run away? Okay. I should have like stealth, like a stealth belt. Uh, do you think I should just fight them? I'm not too worried about it. Oh, skeleton. What the hell is going on here? Some old computer. I need you to boot up the phone again. What? Boot up the phone? Cause look, we're we're trapped in here. Now it's time for puzzle time. Oh god, alright. Something about these rings moving around? Should I save? Again? Let's see what we got. Um, go up. Move system. From left pillar. Let's see what happens. Okay. I just don't know what we need to free them all. Probably gotta move the left one. So we need them all moved to probably one of them to open the door, I think. That's probably what we need to do, right? Because you need to get them all in some kind of direction. Mm -mm. Now I don't know. So use the reset button. Oh, oh well. Oh, I see. There's one. Um, you ready for this? I'm gonna reset it. You ready? Left pillar, middle pillar.
Okay. Then now you need to do left pillar, right pillar. Oh, that's what I have. Okay. And then you're doing middle pillar, right pillar. Then you're doing left pillar, middle pillar. Then right pillar, left pillar. Then you're doing right pillar, middle pillar. Then left pillar, middle pillar. Left to right? Left, middle. Then you're doing left, right. Then you're doing middle, right. Then you're doing middle, left. Then right, left. Then middle, right. Then you're doing left, middle. Then left, right. Then middle, right. Jesus. Who wants to do that? No thanks. You better t drop a full new save for that. That's a migraine and a... Oh, Oh, I was saying you should drop a full new one, but that's fine. God. I get it, but man, that's a weird dance. How'd you ever figure that out? Probably the same way that you did. <laughs> <laughs> Naga shot. Whoa. Blade's probably gonna be important. They're so big body. And only one can attack me at a time. It's pretty funny, actually. Probably or oh fights. My God. What? You got that? You got the strongest force move in the game. Okay. Do you even get the level three lightning now? Level three lightning. Yeah, just set a line. Level three lightning. Not yet. And then set some up to like another line of defense, you know. Are these that strong? 
Yeah. Can't you do like your oh, force I'm, move? I'm stuck in frame nine. What force move? You have it right there. Is that not good? They're immune. Really? Just said it. Okay, okay. Oh, you got stunned. Oh, for like two seconds. Oh my gosh. Damn, they're this tanky. They're tough. Didn't work. Oh, cause he like hit hit. And the game just froze. Is this what we have to go back to? <laughs> I thought my fucking computer crashed. Really? I, I thought th the game. Crashed. I thought my fucking computer was going to crash. Kotor, it'll happen one time at least. It'll happen at least one time. That was play. nuts. That was really scary. That was really scary. I'm glad Chris knew what was going on, but me, I'm like, nope. Well, now we know that we need to put more mines down. They're saying you should just stealth through the room. Alright. You got a stealth belt. You can go through there. Hey, before you leave, editor or lurk, must grab. I O. You know, there's been a cat under your bed this whole stream. Really? I'm not kidding, cause Chewy got scared of the vacuum. I never seen him leave. The Chewy's room. been under my room. I think like two or three hours ago, I saw him go in here. I owed this to you, Baron, from the other day. Time to die. Big time to die up in here, kitty. Yeah, I mean, cat might be under the bed. But yes, thank you for those redemptions. It's all good. It just happens. We get caught into things. I owed that, though. So now we got that. We're all good. Hope your day's been well. I mean, is Chewy under there? I mean, go look down there. Left side. Left side? Yeah. Towards the wall. Towards the wall? Yeah, he's like laying against the wall. Chewy. Seriously, towards the wall? I don't know if I see him. Wait, so how do we use that stealth belt? You already equipped? Just put it on. Where are you at, Chewie? Stealth field generator? There we go. I don't know if he's down here anymore. It's weird. Dude, Dude Chewie is like the solid snake, though, cats. No, he's a big cat, but like... He can literally hide anywhere. He's really good at hiding. He's not that big, though. I've seen a lot of... Yeah, he's cats. just a husky dude. He's fluffy. Husky Harris. Husky Chewy. Yeah, Chewy. There you are. Come here. See? I, I could sense it. Come here. Come here, Chewy. Come here. Come here. Chewy, come here. Okay, come here. I'm just planning on going this way again. Come here. Chuby. We got a Chuby in the chat. I'll get a. Uh, I'll get some snacks for him. That will. That will summon him. Oh my gosh! What? All right. Wish me luck.
Can I still... Oh my gosh, they're still going after me. That is not good. Dude, the stealth didn't work. Stealth, stealth belt didn't work? Stealth didn't work. Can you just go through the door? The door will not open. I have to reload. No! Hey, love it. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta get him out. Son of a gun. So stealth belt did not work? No. But you can go past that area, right? Go check down there. Get your get your sword. Joey, come here. Stream for the stream for the chat. Nice. He's just blocking the blocking the walkway. Uh, Corey, what's up? Can you come here real quick? I think we have an audio issue. We have an audio issue? How do you mean? Well, someone was saying that it, something was mad loud. I don't know what's mad loud. Yeah, I don't know either. I need more context, Mom, than mad loud. I don't know if it was me or the game. Oh, okay. Voice. Maybe the mic? Are you being specific to the mic being loud? Is or my voice? Revan's voice? Corey's voice is a bit loud. Oh. Well, there we go. Oh, thanks, Corey. Just needed more context to L situation. Or Gucci. Thank you, dudes. No, I'm just trying to get this cat out of my bed. I mean, just leave him there. He'll be fine. Yeah, true. He'll come out when he wants to come out. Yeah, that's probably the case. I just turned the gain meter up. Might have went a little extra. Ah, I see. Yep. Oh, hey. So I'm going to save here now. Were you able to get past? Pete just gave hmm. us some bad news. Ooh, that sucks. There we go. Well, hopefully Keith's gonna be okay. Hey, buddy. Were you able to get past them? No. I'm huh. right outside their door. Gotcha. But I have an idea. Yeah, here, look out. Hey, Leo, come here. You got him. So bump the Xbox a little bit. Squeezing in. There we go. Okay. Hopefully, I can just chill back here. I don't like this room. <laughs> it's a cursed room. It's glitchy. Oh, you know what? This could be even a thing. That might be a bit of a factor. Maybe. That one might be a little too far back. We'll see about that setting. Yeah, the only thing, my only concern with the mines is they... As long as they... we get one of them, I can run away from the other one and just throw nades at them. Right. 
It just seemed it didn't do a whole lot of damage, but... I'm not sure if gas masks will do anything. Yeah. Give it a whirl. Red. Cool. Yeah, it's just finding that balance. Wish I had that thermal detonator. Yeah, we had a uh, we had to use a couple of those this uh, session today. It was pretty cool too how one was so important for a quest. Not bad. Did a little bit of damage. Got a few mines left. That one in the corner, though. Yep. Living in the fast lane. This is going to be really tough. Because I don't think I can kill them. Could. They just take forever. But, yeah. I don't know. I don't think uh, the trap ideas gonna suffice for us Ow. how far can you run out of the room can you like it seems like these kind of work on them hold up I don't have any more adhesive grenades that's not good Starting to get over there. Might need to use more stims. Like maybe your shield pack too. Think so. Oh my gosh. These guys are so OP. They are. They're. There's something. Sonic grenades. I know the concussion grenades really helped. Because it can knock them out. Oh, nice. Ouch. I'm just gonna be running a marathon. Right, yeah. It's just going to be a demanding fight. Seriously, thought that one was gonna happen. That's just funny. I thought it was gonna be Chewy. I guess not. So not gonna tough. be Chewy. Running out of grenades, Corey. Most people use the circle strat. Gotcha. Oh, nice. Hopefully, there'll be a couple that I'll be able to. To know, I would imagine. I'll know some of the Pokemans. Gets the job done, apparently. Alright. If anyone can get that job done, I think Chris is the man for it. This is gonna be a really yeah, it's, it's a marathon. I think once I get that force speed ready. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, sweet then. It's Gen 1, easy peasy. 
And if you got, what, about 50 of them? 50 shinies? It's pretty sweet then. Saber throw, that was pretty good. Oh, 15. 15. Don't know why I got the 50 then. Disregard that. Just have to buy more nades when the opportunity rises, you know. I mean, we got credits for it. Right. That guy just sucks at throwing. Right, right, yeah. Do you recall you mentioning that one of the dupes? Oh, but it was a Bulbasaur. Shiny Bulbasaur sounds cool go. though. I finally got a good hit off. That was a nice one. Thing you got med kits for days. And then, yeah, I would say once you have enough saber power to force throw, that should probably be the go to because it did like a 30. It did. Which was, that was pretty strong. Yeah, you just gotta kind of wait till they stop right at a good spot. 25, sure. Keeping that one there. That was good. Why not? Mm. Watch that guy get him in the corner here. Yeah, right in the corner. Ten ski. Ten. Nice. Ooh, shiny Machop, though. What about a shiny Machamp? I mean, you just gotta evolve it, right? Try to go a little deeps on it. Yeah, if only there was a stim that could get your force power up a bit more. Yeah. That's a lot of damage. So close, dude. Too much arm strength on it. Yep. You can do it. He's close. He's very close. My force meter just not going up here. Yeah, you might just have to. Yeah, you might just have to tank and spank this. You're so close. Yep. There you go. Circle around. Hit once. Run again. There you go. You got this now. Just hit and run around. I was running for too long. Time to yep. be my own man. There you go. There you go. Alright, stinky. Yeah, 16. And now, GG. we drop the fattest save of our, of our lives. Nicely yeah, done. Best save in KOTOR. Good stuff, Chris. All of that just to be locked in. Uh, I mean, so I gotta go this way first. We're probably committed to this. It's locked. Not open at the moment. Ah. Uh, well, maybe now you can go. Some other item about to be in here. Special fire grenade. Special cold grenade. Very okay. Weird. This is odd. 
Those are odd. Yeah, more. Probably. Okay. Okie dokie. So we still gotta go one more direction here. Take it right up here. For a second I was like, what are these dinosaurs doing taking a nap? Well, got the dirt nap life. Uh oh. Pool of acid. Oh! Didn't you assume this? Well, ignore him back away and maybe drop a save first before we, uh... Good call. I, I, again, I mean, I don't, it's acid. I don't... Ice grenade and hopefully it becomes icy, but then... Well, I mean, if you don't remember yeah. Luigi's Mansion... Remember the ice area mm -hmm. we had to go to? Right, right. We'll probably the use basement. the fire for hopefully whatever is to come to next. Ouch. That hurt, I bet. Oh, hey, look at that. Starforge. Easy. There you have it. Yep, there's the lightsaber. I wonder where that was stored on the statue. Oh, yeah! Yeah! I could definitely... So oh, shh! I didn't the lightsaber in hand, as I knew you. Here we go. Force has served you well. Here we go. You took a great risk in acquiring the it's going down. You used your mind and your power. No peaceful Get ready. No pacifism. Sometimes you must fight in order to achieve... This gives yeah, you Toka passion. and uh, this makes you stronger. Rosar. This is what makes you superior. From the Toidles. We teach with that part of the final test. The secret of the understand? ooze. Hmm. I I when a Jedi acts, it is with skill, true. But the Jedi teach you that your passions are counterproductive. That strength is only found in peace. Did you not feel a moment of excitement in the tomb? Did your passions not flow and make you feel stronger and more alive? What purpose would be served by restricting No, I was being chased by monsters. I would say only the purpose of the Jedi. <laughs> valid. This, they valid. Control you and Very valid. Your potential. Good. The last part of your test will now commence. Here, you will learn the lesson of competition. All life must compete in order to flourish. Such is the natural way of the universe. To stand still is to know death. One must always be moving forward. So it is the same amongst the Sith. Compete or die, mercy is irrelevant. So it behooves you in this final test to strike down one you are familiar with for no other reason than to prove you are superior and without mercy. Normally, this would be against another student. You, however, get a special treat. You will fight Euthora here, my own apprentice. What? So this is what you had planned all along? You wish me killed? Indeed. You have become too ambitious, Euthora. It is time for you to die and someone more talented to take your place. No. It is time for you to die, Master. My pupil stands with me. Oh, is this true, young one? You wish to join Euthora in her foolish scheme? Whoa, could do I choose me. Would that be the super light sign? Well, I'd have to fight both of them. You both die. Well, I mean, isn't that the light side? You hear that, my master? That is the sound of a new leader rising to replace you. So the time has come, has it? You both wish to okay. stand against Okay, well then if you can do it, you can do it. Okay. Always suspicious. Hey, Hop. Hoptrocity. Wait, did you get did you body him already? Huh? No. Oh, we just got to level up off that. I thought you bodied that guy already. Well, if you want to save point. Oh, okay. Sure. Lightning three now? Wasn't that the... Uh... Yeah. 
Nice. Whoa. A little stun attack, too. You third ain't doing shit. He got super strong all of a sudden. Oh my god, his life. Oh, there you go. Oh. Can't she just like help her brother Oh my god, this is. Oh my. Oh, geez. She just got fucking lost. Uh oh. Don't let her die, Chris. My utopia. Dude, getting that poison life. Jesus. What is this guy? Dude, I think you gotta just force wave him, or is that not possible? We almost had him in the beginning. Hacker man. Hey. He's the most powerful hacker of all Double time. wing there. Thanks, Matt. What's up, dude? Rare records, sweet. Expensive records, more so. Maybe rare, but still nice. Howdy doody. Very close, but. Oh my very god. Scum. This guy is very scum. This feels like an online player now. He's got everything. Yeah, he does. My player two over here isn't doing nothing. <laughs> Super vamp. Sith vamp. Oh, close. Got him. GG. That was a boss fight. Wow. I don't intend to share power. Oh. It's time for you to die. Okay. But I don't want any power. <laughs> I was gonna kill you. Oh, wait, what? I don't want any power. <laughs> Typical. I knew this was coming. Yeah, I mean, they're all good responses. Whatever you want. Time to die. Then you should have no Straight ups. Cool. <laughs> As long as she doesn't have the annoying dream move, then we're all cool. I think you got this. Stop! I healed! You are too strong for me. Gather your hatred and strike me down if that is your will. Not the way of the Jedi! Go on, get out of here. You are no Sith. A real Sith would have no hesitation in striking me down. Good point, time to die. Yeah, probably that one. Then I hope you got what you came to the Academy for, whatever that was. I was right. Yeah, it was beyond that door. Back at the cantina, wasn't I? There is something strange about you. More so than I even suspected. Your path leads elsewhere to a destiny I can only guess at. Whatever it is does not involve joining the Sith. Not yet, at least. Go then. Go and leave here. I'll not stop you. Yeah, light side points. So where's she going then? Uh, going to lay on her bed. Oh, did you grab his stuff? Oh, okay. He's walking through the bed. Oh. Hey, a war, war suit. A war suit. <laughs> well, I guess we're done with Korriban. I see she's just back there still walking. Mm hmm. Lumping. There we go. There we go. There we his o go. I guess Chewie's just gonna keep hanging out under the. Uh, Bad. I guess so.
You got wrestling in an hour. Yeah. You could probably shoot for another, like, 30 minutes. Sure. I'd be fine. Probably wrap up Korriban, figure out where to go to next. I would imagine maybe between... Probably back to the Yavin station, right? Or is that planet... We could check or that... that place out again. Right. Yep. Sweet. Sounds good, Pete. Sweet. Yeah, we'll just probably have that other half an hour to tear down and get ready. Oh, I keep almost going in there. Wrestling watch party? Yeah, yeah, hell, hell yeah, we'll be chilling in the Discord. Watch some wrestling. And Pizza streams it, so just click on the uh on the video in the channel and you're you're rocking and rolling. It's just nine ninety nine for the Panda Pete network. <laughs> oh HK and them were back there. Cool, now they're with you. Oh, I thought like we that what that that, that was action. that was weird. That was really that weird. Was really oh, hey, there's oh, Candace. Right. I was all about to be so, like, well, the entire Sith Enclave's about to go at us. Hey, you do you, homie. All good, Matt. Get it. Make those doll hairs. Yeah, Corbon was... It was an experience, though. It was a good treat. It's a fun place. Some of those quests were pretty... Maybe like the darkest planet ever, but I think it's a fun place to go to. Yeah, I'm, I'm just... Some of those puzzles were a little cryptic, but glad we got through that all. A... Eh. <laughs> These bits ain't growing on trees. Nope. Nope. Cheers to that. Get your dunks. Love it. Thanks, Matt, for the 10 biddies. I can find tech off his hideous Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah. Change up your armor. I think we'll change up the. Uh... No, we'll keep purple. We got to. <laughs> I checked Narkom's, uh, he linked me this kind of heavy weapons guy of KOTOR, the if you will. Forge system. Whoa. That's but first. Gotcha. Yeah, let's go, go peek at Yavin quick. Because we went there, but like nothing really happened, so we're mm -hmm. just going to go back and see if something happens. Starforge system. Interesting. As we fly, friendly reminder for next week, folks. Uh, Monday, we will be doing some Doom Wads. Got a couple single maps we're going to be checking out. Should be pretty fun with that. And then you I like think... Some <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Oh, uh-oh. Got some more ship combat. You got this. Right. Oh, or I can... Sure, why not? Why not? You t take yeah, a break. Sure. Yep. Yeah, we got uh, we got some doom on Monday. Then I think we'll check the Hexen expansion on the following Monday. And then we got Brawl Brothers on Frytog for Wheel of Rip. Of course, Thursday we got more Bro Tour. I am missing these ships terribly. Let go. Oh, cool. Sounds good. Safe travels to holiday. Use the force. And I mean, they're just like on rails. That's the funny part. Hey, two, three. Four. 
four. There you go. And then one more. So bright. Yay! We did it! We did it, chat! We did it. Done, son. All ships blown up by... There we go. <laughs> what do you think? That stars are dark? Yeah, I was gonna say, man, you are staring into a star. <laughs> Pretty bright. Pretty bright. <laughs> Thanks, Marcus. Alright, back to this wacky station. I wish we could actually go to Yav before. Yeah, it's a little bit of a tease to be to be real. Yep. Yep, is just a really fun place to go to. The guy here, the uh, the shop owner or whatever. Yeah, the Rodian. He talks about the uh, the Sith having like temples on Yavin. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> Bring these boys with. I mean, it's just this long stretch to it. The vendor's shop. Ooh, Gears 5 was a little bitter taste at the end. Oh, man. Sorry to hear that. It's too bad. I know a couple people that really enjoy the Gears series. It's restricted by the armor? Mm. It's messed up. I'm trying to find something cool to wear for like the final battle. Oh yeah, because we got that coming up here. I do not know. We'll skip this. Just okay. Can't use four speed. So game was fun. Gameplay was sweet. Uh oh. Just What's oh, this? drop a save. This is probably what we want now. Got to figure out how to make these guys. Uh, you gotta fight him or do something with him. Finally get to see a Trondoshan up in here. They're not even making noises or any. Like what? This is weird. Why aren't they talking? It's like their vo voice files don't exist. I'll ask you again, very politely. <laughs> we'll be back for you, human. Let's, should we try a different dialogue? I want to see if we can fight them. Well, see if we can fight these guys. I thought you said, like, dead or alive. It's really strange though that they don't whoa that they don't have like voice files. That's it, now you die? Sure. Nope, we'll be back. Do they run somewhere else, or...? I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know either. 
or it's just supposed to be a scripted event. Like, I do think it's possible that this guy is just kind of like the middle of nowhere vendor. Well, not really. He's in Yavin, but, you know, he's just a vendor. That's about it. I don't know if there's much else. Does he doesn't have a like Star Forge piece. going on right now in Yavin, though. Right. He doesn't have, like, a Star Forge piece or anything, so it's more of a side place. Where was the cheapest shop we could go to? Because we should stack up on items. Hmm. Good point. Too bad we can't go to Dantooine. You wanna go to Tatooine? It's probably gonna be our best bet. It's probably going to be Tatooine. Is that going to be our final planet then? I believe so. Alright. We're going to the Star Force system. So we'll stock up and get ready for the uh, the big final conclusion, I guess, on Thursday. Are we at least gonna land at the next place? Yeah, we can do that. Okay. Go to Tatooine, stock up, then we'll go to the final place, see what cutscene story kind of give yeah. us a, a taste, and then uh, I think we can call it for the day. And then, yeah, if that works out, if we're able to finish this game on Thursday, then I think there might be a few Thursdays and Sundays where I'm just going to kind of do some, like, recess streams, and then I think we may try to do the, uh, the KOTOR 2, because this has been pretty fun for yeah. us. I just got to look into uh, figuring out how to get all the extra content in there and see if there's controller support. That'll be our big thing to figure out. And if not, we gotta just mouse and keyboard it. Now you're gonna be doing like cool like graphic mods to make the game look really nice too. Yeah, we'll just have to see what all is good and available and anything that doesn't. I mean, anything that just makes the game look clean. Right. Yeah. Yeah, there'll probably be like a decent texture update. Some mods but... look fun. Yeah, and I mean like yeah. this is fine, oh, yeah. especially on you know. Playing technically an Xbox build of the game. We're literally playing on an Xbox one. That is wild, yes. Could that be why it froze, maybe? Oh, yeah. I mean, the game crashed. The client crashed. Or wasn't it this place? One too much? Hey, hey, mm. Excuse me. I'm pretty sure there's a vendor in there that you can speak with. Probably the Ithorian. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I'll buy like 10 of these. Alright, go check out another vendor. Need mines. Mm -hmm. Too bad we can't go to Terrace. Yeah, or Manon. Well, Corbon had something. Yeah, there were some vendors there. I think there was... Um, I think the Rodian at the front desk? And you could see the guy who sold the droid. He might have some stuff. Ooh, life support. Computer spikes. Ooh. Uh-oh. That's expensive. We might have some stuff, though, we could sell if we want to. Are the mines really... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that stuff's going to be important. Because I got a little bit of an idea of what we got going on at the final planet. Which, I can see those being beneficial. It's not that, it's after that. Oh, Okay. Same for the final area. What I learned was if you have like a lot of mines, it just makes your job a lot easier. Okay. I will not complain with that. Did we want to travel to oh, one other there planet? another dude out here? Yeah. He probably has something. It's like a mall. 
Cecilia! He's infinite. Nice. There was one more shop I wanted to go to. A different planet. Yes, what's on your mind? Oh, nothing. <laughs> It's funny. It's really our own choice. Sure. Well, I mean, cash I remember there was a weapon shop there. Yeah, thank buzz you. off, Karth. Super buzz off. Just sit in the seat. Just leave us alone. It'd be cool if Bastila was here and you stayed back there. Thank you. Thank you. Am I doing this again? I got it this time. Alright. I wonder if they can actually blow up the ship. Oh, I think they can. Speaking of that, I got to see the, uh, oh, you got to see the Mystery Science 3000 episode of Mitchell? Excellent. What'd you think? All in the glory of Schlitz. It was everything I hoped for. Yes. Yes. Nice. That was cool. Yeah, classic MST3K. Should rewatch that. There we go. Boom. Nice. JDB doesn't get much love in Twitchland. No, not too much, but you know, there's a there's a couple of oasises around here that gives him his dues. Yep, exactly. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I mean Mr. Mr. Baker's got some he's got some fun flicks. We'll bring it certainly does. With us. I'm a little bummed my Mitchell button fell off my jacket and disappeared. It's too bad. I'm oh, sure it brings you honey with the Jedi squad. Are you just trying to buy some, uh, maybe grenades, or...? Yeah, I know exactly where I have to go. Ah, okay. Cool. Greetings. If... Pretty sure, is it...? Okay. No, Do come no. again! I thought he was the guy selling stuff. One of them were... That's true. That's true. Um, a view to, wait, a view to kill? 
for the 80s, right? For him being, uh... I mean, he's also been on the opposite end for that in Bond. Yeah, I'll talk to him. He's kind of sort of in GoldenEye in the video game. Really? Is he like a background character, or... Oh, License to Kill. Not a view to kill. Or it could be for the free food. What's the gunk that comes out of a synthesizer on this bucket anyway? Do you never clean the darn thing? Right, that's the case. I'm old, Golden Eye and Tomorrow I'm Never Dies, to different character. I want to be. And, you know, you... Oh! He's never seen in the game, but he's part of an so objective in the later you. game. Dude, the that's kind of cool. And you'd think if uh, if he's in Golden Eye... Sometimes, well, it turns Dude, Joel, Joe Don Baker, Golden Eye, the secret character. Does it have to have a point? Let's see. Well, he had a much better. I was just about now. You've Grant has his own. Mm -hmm. Well, Grant decides finally. Maybe and yeah, just kind of a everyone Bond lore moment. Building the relationships. I hate you. Oh my goodness. What? Are you kidding? What are they? You should do so well as to be sucked. Anyway, go on. My throat. <laughs> JDB died as a villain and came back as a good guy. Reincarnated. Uh oh. How may I be of assistance to you, Padawan? What is it you would like? Well, she's the one that wanted to talk. I, I think yeah, you can just go through real quick. I have. Been, I keep thinking that more time would do. I think that is. Yeah, there you go. Or wait, I cannot. I thank you. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Good old. I'm just thinking that the clob. But that was in a. That was in Perfect Dark though. Whoa! Oh, you, whoa! Ho, ho. Look at that lie! It wasn't me. Huh. <laughs> Hmm. There you go. Whoa, lots of thermals. That's all he's got. Just thermals for days. Now, how do you get down? Well, you gotta play as another character. Oh, thank God. That would have sucked. <laughs> Jeez, you got on the bar table. I wonder how many people have ever done that. Who else are you looking for? Um, all I know is that there's some type of vendor here. That I remember. Yeah, that, that might have been it. Are we just ready to go then? Yeah, I'm cool with that. Maybe there's a vendor on the Starforge. Potentially. <laughs> I know, right? Dang. Well said. How could they put this out? All these bugs getting on bar tables. Beeps randomly. Yeah, random beeps. Game breaking Hollywood blockbuster bugs. Uh, what? 
Yeah, this is okay. What do we got here? Excuse me, have you seen a mechanic about? Short fellow, bald, I've been looking. Well, I'll be a Wookiee's uncle. Davin? Davin Coachress? <laughs> Jolie? Hey. Jolie Why, you old freak. Look at that. Last time I saw you, you were still wandering the galaxy in that old tug. In plays droids. You. I crashed somewhere and decided to stay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, this is cool, man. though. Wasn't yeah, anticipating this kind of quest happening. Exactly the same as the last maybe at different landing you. points. You well. But maybe he's on Korriban. Uh, not the young lad anymore yourself, I see. What are you, deaf? His name's Davin. Old friend from my wanderer days. By the by, Davin. Different really Davin. Of course, <laughs> kind of Davik. Oh, oh, Davik, Davin. No, why? Yeah. What's there to hear? He's been picked up by the Silcas authorities on Milan. Well, murder. that's preposterous. We can't go I on know. there. Melora is beside herself, as you can imagine. Maybe you could help them. I'm sure Sunray would appreciate a Jedi's assistance right about now. Perhaps I will at that. It's up to my friend here, actually. I'm just tagging along. Yeah, fun fact. Uh... Jolie is actually voiced I, by Sarah Vock from Baldur's Gate. Same voice actor. He's done so many different things. Pretty amazing. And we can try to go back there, but I'm not sure if it'll let us. Yeah, I have no idea. I don't think we're going to be able to gain access. Feel free to take a look if you want. I think I already know what the event is, but for the LOL, we could check. I mean, maybe Jolie can check. Maybe. Put Jolie on free mode and then he can do it? Maybe. Okay. Kevin Michael Richardson. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, he he's done a lot. His IMDB is deep. Lots of shows, video games. Superheroes, you name it. Alright. Let's see about Manan. Sure we're permanently banned from this place, but we'll see. Right, if, uh, could you do Jolie on solo mode, and then maybe? I don't think he can just go out there. Oh, okay. Cool, Baron. Thank you. Yeah, I'll probably just go, like, Kerchunk. Kerchunk. Yeah, see, it's all your fault. <laughs> it's all your I fault. Knew it. Nope, denied. It's funny that they at least let us park well, there. We don't need this knockoff scare if anyways, can you know, whatever. Fair enough. Alright, let's go take a peek at the Starforge system. Oh. You are strong, child. But I will break you. 
I'll never fall to the dark side. <coughs> you think torture will turn me, Malik? You are a fool. Torture? No, dear Bastula. You misunderstand. This is but a taste of the dark side to whet your appetite. When you finally swear loyalty to me, it will be willingly. Never. <laughs> Such resolve in your words, but I see the truth in your heart. The dark side calls to you, Bastula. You hunger to taste it. Become my apprentice, and all its power can be yours. <laughs> Oh, God. Interesting. Interesting. The Star Forge. Ooh. Oh, sweet. I've never seen anything like it. I'm transmitting these coordinates to Admiral Dodonna. Maybe a quick strike by the Republic can cripple the Sith fleet. Message is away. Now we can just wait for the Republic to show up. We should be safe here. We're outside their sensor range. Small vanguard of Sith fighters coming in hard. Someone needs to get on those gun turrets. Take those fighters out before they report our position to the main fleet. Oh, this cutscene again. <laughs> I love how they use this as like the scripted loading scene for the uh, the ship combat. Just like you couldn't have like an alternate one. I hope we can at least see like the Star Forge in the background. Oh, that'd be cool. They should. I mean, we see the planet there. Oh, oh yeah, there you go. There. Cool. That's good then. That's a nice touch. Nicely done. Good stuff. Oh, we've got problems. We've flown in some kind of disruptor field. All my instruments are jammed. We've got massive overloads in all systems. I'm picking up a <laughs> single planet in this system. I'll try and put us down there. Hold Fact, on. Matt. This may be a rough landing. Dude, it's almost like he kind of has like a corset, it seems. Just with that style of armor. Oh, we're going to the planet first? Ooh. What are those more Star Forges? Maybe there's a big battle over the Star Forge a while back. Yo, and also, are we on Scarif Kappa? I don't know. I wouldn't think so. And I believe Whoa. that they Talk said this was an unknown planet, Tarth. though. What's the matter? You're flying like you've been on an all-night Teresian ale drinking binge. That disruptor field fried our stabilizers. We're lucky we made it down in one piece. But if I can't find the salvage to make repairs, I won't even be able to get the Evan Hawk airborne again. Huh. <laughs> 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 the Gizka. I noticed the holes of many crashed ships. The Cathar's right. This planet's a technological graveyard. 
I saw dozens of downed ships out there. That disruptor field must have wiped them all out. But where could it be coming from? Even if we get the stabilizers fixed, we have to find and disable the source of that disruptor field before we can take off. Otherwise, we'll just end up crashing again. Ah, so I see what's going on. Right. That Sith fleet we saw must One more planet before Star Forge. That's cool, then. We have to find a way to disable it, or the Republic will be slaughtered. T3's picking up massive power fluctuations on the ship's sensors. They seem to be coming from some type of large stone structure to the east. It looks like some kind of ancient temple. Good idea. If that temple's generating power, it probably has something to do with that disruptor field. Hey, don't forget about Bastila, guys. We still have to Bastila. rescue her, too. I only hope we're not too Bastila. Busy. Bastila has been Malak's prisoner for a long time. If he can turn her to the dark side, she will join him, and the Sith will be invincible. I fear Bastila will find the lure of the dark side difficult to resist. She is strong in the Force, but she is also impulsive, willful, and proud, as you once were, Revan. Let us hope it does not come to that. Well, if Bastila's on the Starforge like you think, Jolie, then we can't rescue her until we disable that disruptor field. The sooner we investigate that temple to the east, the better. We can probably find the wreckage of a downed ship along the way. If we're lucky, we can salvage some stabilizers from it to get off this planet. I hope everything works out as smooth as you make it sound, Card. Well, so do I, Mission. So do I. Cool. Well, maybe we can at least take a like, peek outside. Step outside and get like a breath of fresh air. See what the air tastes like here. Are you doing this? Sure, whatever you want. It's great, kid. Now don't get cocky. So it seems like there's a lot of crashed ships out here. Mm hmm. And that. I don't think that's the Star Forge. Well, they just look like destroyed forges or something. I don't know. Or like just gigantic ships. Yeah. There must have been like a giant battle out here, or that disruptor field just caused mm -hmm. everything to crash. Yeah, kind of like that big one right there. Was there a chest over there? There's a chest over there. Oh, we're playing Sea of Thieves now. Yeah, I guess. Yes. Yeah, we can we'll save. save we'll call it here for today. Good stuff, fun stuff in the land of KOTOR, everybody. Appreciate all of you for hanging out. Yeah, it was a lot of fun today. Yes. Well, we got maybe one more episode, two at the max. Yeah, probably. Probably about one or two from the look of things. So, cool. Alright, guys, this is probably where we're going to ship on out of here tonight. Um, do you mind... Or actually, we can just keep it like that. That's fine. Like that for now. I can show it off after. Yeah. Hey, thanks, Blizzard. Yeah, good stuff today. You got that right, Baron. Yeah, some. Delete. Some good Delete. stuff. Delete. 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 Fractured butthole. No. Dude, that would have been so much fun. Dude, that game's kind of spicy maybe though. Maybe replay Stick of Truth stream that one maybe yeah. maybe we'll see we'll see i still kind of hope those guys got another game in the works but digressing from there we're gonna get ready to roll and get ready to watch the wrestling like pete said if anyone wants to watch be in the discord read what you want to read believe what you want to believe but go to bed thank you thank you rick flair that's the one I wanted to press, actually. Oh, really? Yeah, so I'm glad it all worked out. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Yeah, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for some Doom FPS action. Keep an eye out for that. Monday Night Doom. That's right. Okay, thank you, everyone. Keep being rad, keep being breathtaking. We'll see you on the next stream. See you, everybody. Okay, Boomer.